John Aniston was a television legend who just passed away. And the news is going out today about his, his passing. His daughter, the famous Jennifer Aniston, posted on her social media on IG, um, a really beautiful tribute to her dad. So as people are pouring in their love and support of John Aniston and his work, I want to mention about his work because it's very important. Um, I never got a chance to meet John. I saw him in person a couple of times, but I never got a chance to interview him uh, or, or actually meet him. Uh, but I admired him and his character. And so John Aniston didn't, didn't first, his first sub role wasn't on Days of Our Lives. But coming out of Days of Our Lives in 1985, nearly 40 years ago, he made history um, bringing the Greek character to life uh, on soaps. And Greeks weren't popular on soap operas, I think. You have them and the Cassidines on, on General Hospital. Um, but it was nice to see that and the heritage and that he would bring that as part of the, the role all these years. And he's Greek himself. Uh, but I always say he's one of he was one of the last of those characters I call J.R. Ewing esque characters because um, this the male the strong male who was you know ruthless in business, um, but as their hearts would melt when it came to family, but it also kind of be a little ruthless in family um, for the sake of the business. You know, like it was it was always one of those things. I. I I think some other names in the business, other characters in the business, like Azo Buchanan, H.B. Lewis, Stefano Demira, Victor Newman, Richard Channing, Greg Sumner, Mason Capwell, even C.C. Capwell, Edward Quartermain, and then we add Victor Kiriakis. And there are other others, too, from other soaps. Uh, those are some of the main ones that got very popular. Um, soaps started out as a woman's medium to have these gentlemen come in and put indelible stamps on these roles and win over women and bring some male viewers uh, to the shows is incredible. John Aniston, I loved his character over here. I guess we love to hate him. First of all, back in the day, I will never forget the Bo and Carly and, and Victor and but his soft side with Caroline. And I mean, him and Maggie, of course, years later. I mean, like, it's just, so I've been going forever. I'm sure there'll be people talking about his career um on days and it was, it was on last week um and it was just wonderful that he would have some of the best one-liners on the, on the show oh my god some of the best one-liners of the show they did a game some good stuff and you could deliver them with just you know um with john aniston's role of victor kiyakis is very important as far as now and now it's gonna be in the annals of soap history as one of the best characters ever created in my opinion, um, it does. I mean, it's just, it's, the Kiriakis family is a fixture on Days of Our Lives. It's one of the families, Days of Our Lives. And he was ahead of that. Um, don't know how they're going to handle it on the show, uh, but Days usually good about handling that kind of stuff on there. So it should be interesting. Um, but I just want people to not forget, you know, the work that he did. And he just did some fascinating, wonderful work over the years. Um, playing complex beats to stories where one minute you're cheering him on the next minute you're hating him the next minute you're pissed at him the next minute you're rooting for him um and he did it all with great acting and he brought it to life um that's something that's not easy and in the soap world let's not forget you're learning pages and pages and pages of dialogue and the pacing is so fast uh that we don't want to forget that either and he did it it may look may look easy May look easy. Um, so for me, it's a, for me personally, it's like a piece of my childhood and teenage years and young adulthood is like, oh, it's like, it's, I mean, there's a lot of, a lot of, there's not the, many of those names I mentioned, you know, those actors aren't here with us anymore. We're getting down to the, the nitty gritty. Um, but I appreciate uh, his work and what he did for us. Oh, nearly 40 years on Days of Our Lives. And Days will not be the same without him. It'll still be, it'll be a good show. But he just, he always, when you when he came on screen, you were wanting to see what he's going to say, what he was going to do. Um, that's And that's, again, another trait that not all actors can pull off. He he pulled it off. You, you were watching him when he was on screen. 
So rest in peace, John Aniston. You did great work. You left on a, you left behind a long and wonderful legacy. I mean, that this you can't deny that at all. Your long, wonderful legacy for for us to remember you by. And I look forward to seeing all the tributes that come up in the next few days and few weeks uh, honoring you. But here at Daytime Today, and myself, James Live Jr. and JLJ Media, we will miss you. And, uh, and thank you for all you did for our daytime community.